Hi everyone, in this video I will present the Breeden Litzenberger formula which links the second order derivatives of vanilla call option prices with the risk neutral density function and we will see how to apply it to value exotic payoffs. There is a duality between option prices and the risk neutral density function. If we represent option prices in terms of their Black-Scholes implied volatility and we compare the distribution of log returns and the volatility curve as a function of the strike prices, a normal distribution means a flat volatility curve, a fat-tailed distribution creates a volatility smile with higher tail risk and higher implied volatilities on the right and on the left side, while a negatively skewed return distribution will create a volatility smirk with higher implied volatilities on the left side compared to the right side. Breeden and Nitzenberger showed in 1978 that there is a direct relationship between the risk neutral density of an asset price and the second order derivatives of call prices with respect to the strike price. The risk neutral density at the strike price k is equal to the second order derivatives of the call price at k times exponential r times t with r the risk free interest rates and t the time to maturity. So let's demonstrate it. Under the non arbitrage assumption with no transaction cost, the price of a call option is the discounted expectation of its final payoff under the risk neutral probability q. We write it in integral form with f the risk neutral density for st. It can be rewritten as following with the integral from k to plus infinity. So we calculate the derivatives of this latest expression with respect to k. We develop the derivatives of the integral function with two terms. We easily see that the first one is equal to zero while the second one simplifies. So we get this expression for the derivatives of the call price. And if we calculate the second order derivatives, we obtain the breeder nitzenberger formula. As an exercise, you can show that this is true in the special case of the Black-Scholes model using the Black-Scholes closed form solution for the price of a call option and calculating its second derivatives with respect to the strike price. The second order derivatives of the call price can be proxy by central finite difference. And we easily see that the risk neutral density is directly related to the price of a butterfly centered at k. This relationship is independent of the model chosen to value options. Assuming that we have option prices for the different strikes and we are able to calculate the second derivatives, we can use it directly to estimate the risk neutral density. In practice, for a given maturity t, we have several observable market prices for several strikes ki. We choose a model to value smoothly options on the different strikes, such as SVI or SABR, and we use the breeder nitzenberger formula to estimate the risk neutral density for the time to maturity t. The risk neutral density can then be used to value exotic option payoffs. For that, we calculate the price of the option as a discounted expectation of its final payoff h under the risk neutral probability q, and we use the risk neutral density to calculate it by numerical integration. Thank you for your time.